This one idea improves every monster encounter I design. The monsters know what they're doing. In his book, Keith Amon uses stat blocks and lore to create a set of monster tactics. For example, a dark mantle, these cave squids. Using only the monster manual, I might have had it drop from the ceiling and cast magical darkness using darkness aura, since that's what it suggests. And then, probably while running the encounter, I realize, that's it. My monster is out of actions and it hasn't even attacked. Now the players will probably get the first shot and it doesn't have a lot of hit points. Shoot. But Keith suggests the dark mantle is an ambush predator. It picks a low ceiling and casts magical darkness from there. Then it waits around before it drops and attacks with advantage. It has no reason to move until it's ready to attack. I love this insight. It makes me excited to run an encounter with a dark mantle, or maybe 10 of them. We'll see.